Hey, yeah, last year we saved you money and frustration, warning you against counterfeit toys being sold online. And this year we are back again with the newest fakes hitting the market, getting sold to you in record numbers right now. Look, with inflation being as high as it is, you get excited over a good deal online. I don't blame you. But before you click that buy button, I want to show you what this stuff really looks like when it gets to your house. I've got brand new examples and tips on how to catch the fakes before you hit add to cart. We're working with the Toy Association, exposing the hot fakes right now. Star Wars action figures, you can see they're pretty cool. I can even open it up for a second. This is brand new. I can't, this is the fastest I've ever been able to open a toy. In my house, this would take me an hour. They move, right, they move. This is real, right? But wait until you see this. We order another toy online. The product looks fine, but when it arrives, guess what came? This. This is what came in the mail. And watch what happens. So, for example, that's the real one right there. Here's the real one. Look how the fake came. <laughs> I mean, what? What are you talking about, okay? And it's the same for all these. Here's the, this is the fake one right here. Here's the real one. Look at the fake and you can see on its head like the paint is all off, okay? And one other example I wanna show you. Here's this, this girl right here. I mean, look, full on movement and all that stuff. And this is the fake that came that's supposed to be her. I mean, are you joking me? Look at the paint job on the, on the hair. And it's not just the look of it. These counterfeits can be downright dangerous. They haven't been tested. They haven't been certified. And they may use unsafe materials or components within the toy, such as chemicals or other materials that are banned. And they may break, they may create small parts, sharp edges, sharp points, which are of course choking hazards and laceration issues. To make sure you're getting the real deal, there are key things you should look for in the packaging too. Marvel Hulk gloves, popular toy this season. This is the real one and you can see it's good quality, but here's what you really want to be able to look for. Look on the package right there. It says Marvel. Look right down over here. Hasbro, the maker of the product, right? That's right there on the packaging and that's how it comes. That's the real deal. We ordered others and this is how they came. And when we pulled it out, ripped the stuff, like, you know, just ready to, ready to come out. So this is garbage. This is the real deal. But here's the thing, you're more at risk right now than ever, thanks to inflation. All products are being impacted, not just toys. Prices are increasing on all of that. But that op opens up this wider opportunity for an unscrupulous seller to swoop in, to make products that don't comply, to use lesser quality materials in production, and to put your child at risk. Okay, so how can you fight back against this? If you're buying on Amazon, for example, the best thing you can do is figure out who sells the toy. How do you do that? I'm about to show you. On the right-hand side, so here's where the actual toy is being sold, right there. On the right-hand side, look at that. It says sold by. I want you to click on the company name. It should take you to a legitimate store with a location and a number you can call. Now, there's something else I want you to check. Scroll back up, okay? The same thing right here, under the name of the actual toy, there should be a link to the brand or the manufacturer, which is right over here. Click that, then you know these toys being listed are real, okay? Do that before you hit buy. Hope that helps, back to you.